One of the best things you can do if you are trying to lose weight is to add a lot of high volume, low calorie foods to your diet. In this video, I'm gonna go over 10 foods that you can consider adding that are all within just 50 calories. Let's do this. Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. If you are trying to lose weight, you better be stacking your kitchen up with a lot of low calorie foods, especially the ones that are easy to prepare or easy to grab and go. Adding a lot of high volume, low calorie foods to your diet not only uh, helps you stay in a calorie deficit, but it also helps you stay full. Uh, and that's always something I talk about on this channel. Dieting or losing weight does not mean you need to go on starvation mode, you need to crash diet and start feeling like shit. You still want to be eating as much food as you can which are dense with nutrients and keeps you full so that you have all the energy that you need to get on with your day, to have a good workout and to overall feel good. So in this video, I'm going to go over 10 foods that you can consider adding to your diet if you are trying to lose weight and they are all within 50 calories. If you are ready to get this video underway, as always, go ahead, like the video, subscribe, hit that button, and let's get started. Number one on the list is papaya. A lot of people don't like papaya. I absolutely love it. I think it tastes amazing. And if you're one of those who also enjoys eating them, then I highly recommend adding them to your diet. Uh, they are loaded with uh, antioxidants and vitamins and 100 grams of it is just 43 calories. Number two is pineapple. It's another fruit I love having. 100 grams of pineapple is just 50 calories. Uh, not only does it taste amazing and refreshing, but it's also high in vitamins, um, antioxidants and fiber. Another thing with pineapple is that it's usually good to have them after a high protein meal because they contain digestive enzymes uh, which could help break down the protein and also aid with digestion. Number three on the list, strawberries. Another great low calorie fruit guys. Uh, tastes so incredibly good. They are rich in vitamin C and other antioxidants. 100 grams of strawberries are just 32 calories. Number four on the list, mushrooms. Now mushroom is a kind of food you either love or you hate. I personally like having mushrooms. I don't really mind them. Uh, they are packed with nutrients and 100 grams of mushrooms are about 22 to 25 calories. You might not be able to eat them just like that, but hey, season them a bit. Uh, saute it on a pan for some time, bake them in an oven for a few minutes and you should be good to go. You can also add them to different kind of curries to bump up the volume without necessarily bumping up the calories. Number five on the list is cucumber. Now cucumbers are great low calorie foods and they're also really good to fill you up because they contain high water content. Uh, 100 grams of it is just 15 calories. So eat as much as you want guys because in terms of calories you really cannot go wrong with cucumber. One recommendation though is to eat it with the skin uh, as that contains a lot of fiber, vitamins and minerals. Number six on the list is watermelon. It, I have spoken about this quite a bit in the past but it is by far the best thirst quenching fruit. As the name implies about 90% of it is made up of water. 100 grams of watermelon guys is just 30 calories making it an excellent weight loss friendly food. Number seven on the list Peaches, another great summer fruit to have. I am personally not a big fan of them, but nonetheless are a great low calorie food. Uh, 100 grams of them are just 39 calories. Apart from them being lower in calories, they also have a ton of health benefits, including improved digestion, good for the heart, and a strong immune system. Number eight on the list, carrots. An amazing, quick and easy, low calorie vegetable to have. You can have them raw as a snack or you can add them to your carrot cake overnight oats like I do. Uh, and 100 grams of them guys are just 40 calories. Number nine on the list, egg whites. Now, one whole egg is about 75 calories, but if you remove the yolk and have just the egg whites, that's just 17 calories and you're getting about four grams of protein. So you can get a total of about eight to 10 grams of protein within 50 calories, guys. And finally, number 10 on the list is asparagus. I am a huge fan of asparagus, guys. I have them all the time. I usually just spread them out on a baking tray, uh, add some olive oil, sprinkle some garlic powder, and uh, just bake them for about 15 minutes and they turn out to be so crunchy and delicious. They're also packed with vitamins, minerals, and fiber, and 100 grams of them are just 20 calories. 
there you have it guys 10 foods within 50 calories now obviously the list does not end here there are plenty of foods out there that are just as low in calories as these and they can be added to your diet as well uh, i just wanted to go over a few that i personally add to my diet or the ones that i recommend to my clients so hopefully you enjoyed it hopefully you found it informative if you did please go ahead like the video subscribe if you haven't already and until next time you take care, you stay safe, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.